sorry. Hey, y'all, look. You ever had one of them days where you felt like bad luck was just following you wherever you went, no matter how high you were vibing, like low vibrational stuff just continued to follow you? That was my day today. So I'm not going to get into too much detail about all of the low vibrational stuff that was happening to me. Um, but I will tell you that it led me to the health food store. Um, typically, when I'm feeling like, you know, low vibes is just trying to attack me, I go to the health food store because they have different herbs, teas, um, elixirs, oils, everything, you know what I'm saying, incense, everything to just keep my vibes high, y'all, because... Let me tell you, it started with me, I woke up to my credit score tanked over 60 points due to, um, I think that a Wells Fargo reported that I had a late payment, but I just paid the car off. So that blew me because I was on my way to the Benz dealership today, like truth be told, I was on my way to the Benz dealership to give me a business vehicle but with that tanked i was like damn like you know maybe this is a sign maybe now is not a time for me to purchase that vehicle so you know i talked myself down i wasn't too disappointed you know what i'm saying because i took it as a lesson and not an l right so that happened now my son was supposed to get picked up by his dad my ex-husband to spend a weekend with him so i got a whole schedule lined up he was supposed to pick him up at 10 o'clock, right? So I dropped him off at my parents' house for him to get picked up by his dad. I got a 9 o'clock a.m. appointment at a bank so I can open two new business accounts, okay? Then after that, I had my appointment set for the dealership, but I canceled, you know, I was up front, canceled that. And I was, my intention was to go to the nail shop, go get waxed, um go what else I had lined up nails wax you know just uh just all the self-care stuff you know what I'm saying I had that plan for today so I go to the bank and not this is a whole not that's a whole nother video y'all like for real I go to the bank that was an experience lead a bank shoot to the nail shop no sooner than I've been sitting in the pedicure chair for about 10 minutes, no, nah, not even 10 minutes, 5 minutes, I get a call from my dad like, hey, just letting you know that um, me and LJ were waiting outside for about 20, 25 minutes. So I had LJ FaceTime his dad and his dad said that he's not in Chicago, he's not coming. That happened. So immediately my heart is hurting for my son because I'm like, damn, how could you disappoint a four-year-old? But anyway, so here come the low vibes, right? First the bank, now the ex. And I'm like, okay, just breathe, you know, Nicole. You getting your nails done, you're supposed to be in your vibe, just chill. So I'm chilling, nails done, boom. Um, so I'm like, you know what? I'm not gonna let this room, you know, my dad, like, you know, we got him, we handle what you gotta handle. Cool. So I'm like, I'm not gonna let this room on my day. So I got an appointment for eyebrows and lashes and stuff. So I'm like, you know what? I'm finna roll to the health food store. One of my favorite health food stores um, in a Beverly neighborhood on the south side of Chicago. I go there and I get a bunch of stuff. So I'm about to share with y'all everything that I got, right? All the low vibrational stuff. I'm gonna get into detail about that bank because that was some BS, but and even about the whole co-parenting thing. But y'all, I'm so excited to share with y'all some of the things that I got. Okay, so first things first, I got me some, I've never tried this before, but I'm like, no, Cole, you need to relax. So I found these relaxing lavender shower salts. I never even heard of shower salt, but basically it's some salts that you can sprinkle in the bottom of your shower you let it steam and the aroma from the lavender you know lavender is super it's supposed to help with um relief of stress 
helps you sleep. So I'm really excited to try this out. So this was like, I think this was like 12 bucks. So I got me some lavender shower sauce that I am definitely gonna try tonight because people been foot working on my last nerve. Gee. Um, so I got the shower salt. Then I got me some some pure Castile soap. I got some Dr. Bronner's Castile soap. You know, I'm trying to leave all of the doves and the, you know, that soap that we shouldn't be using, but we use it because that's just what we grew up on. So I got some pure Castile soap and I got the hemp almond. I think I've tried, I've tried this one before and I love the almond smell. It smells so sweet. It leaves your skin clean, ain't no residue on it. It doesn't dry it out. So I got this. This is a small one. This is the 16 ounce. This was like 11 bucks. I'm using this light. Next thing I got, I got some ashwagandha capsules. Ashwagandha is a type of uh, mushroom and it reduces stress. So I got me some ashwagandha capsules because baby, I'm finna reduce this stress because Mm -mm. I ain't got time for that. So that's the first bag. My second bag, I got me some, it smells so bad, but some valerian root tea. I love Buddha teas. Like they have every tea under the sun that you can imagine for any ailment. So valerian root is a natural sleep aid. And I learned about valerian root from this company. Um, I forget the name of the company, but they make this product that's so good, y'all. I've been waiting on this product to get delivered to me since Black Friday. It's May 27th, and I'm still waiting on this stuff. It's so good that I'm still waiting for it, and I'm definitely going to post a video about it because that product, I can't drop the name because I'm making my video about it, but it's so raw. But valerian root tea is a natural sleep aid. It helps and it helps reduce, you know, stress, anxiety and stuff. It's not recommended for women to take if you're pregnant or breastfeeding though. But yeah, um, valerian root, I believe also helps with um, inflammation. But just on it, it says an ancient herb for a long, peaceful night. And to be completely transparent with y'all, I've been, um, like I just stopped, I'm trying to give up. Mary Jane, um, I have a medical card for PTSD from working in a prison, believe it or not. So I'm just trying to get myself off of that because I feel like Mary Jane, it steals your youth. Like, I feel like it makes your lips dark. It can make your skin look dull and ashen and it can mess up your gums and stuff. And I'm just like, I'm trying to go a different route. So yeah valerian root tea and i'm not gonna lie it smells disgusting but can't wait to try it in this raw form like that in a tea i got me some yogi tea i like the yogi brand too my favorite favorite um flavor from them is the lemon ginger the lemon ginger is good because like it's like a natural detox it's relaxing i don't put no honey or nothing in my teas i just drink it straight so but this time i got me some rose hip skin detox and it's supposed to support a healthy glowing skin and i'm really trying to work on my skin because fortunately i be dealing with adult acne um just due to stress but like when i'm eating right like when i'm eating my salads every day like i'm supposed to which i have been my see my stuff is glowing now baby it's glowing but i can't wait to try this uh rose hibiscus skin detox so i can glow even more baby got that i got me some chlorophyll some chlorophyll liquid drops now this is good because it helps to um it basically feeds oxygen to your blood um it maximizes your lung function again stopping at mary jane um and it's just really good you know chlorophyll is what gives plants their colors is why we consume greens um salads and things of that nature so if you don't consume salads get you some chlorophyll like when i was taking chlorophyll last time like i did not use deodorant like it helps with so much like chlorophyll so what how i take it you can either just drop put a couple of drops directly in your mouth or drop some in some water and drink it. It doesn't stain your teeth or anything. So I got me some chlorophyll. 
Yeah, I'm really, I'm really trying to keep my frequencies high. You feel me? So, Corfia. And then I came across these hand rolled um, incense, and the flavor is Palo Santo and cinnamon. Now, Palo Santo, I got some. This Palo Santo, I burn it, and it basically helps keep your vibes high. Combine it with cinnamon, y'all. Cinnamon attracts abundance, baby, and I am definitely trying to bring in that bag. So I got me some hand rolled incense, and I can't wait to smell these. Um, yeah. Then the last thing I got is kind of irrelevant. Um, I'm a, I got a sweet tooth, and I've been leaving the sugar alone because I'm trying to reduce inflammation in my body and stuff like that, and clear up my skin. So I got me some some honey. It's just literally just honey drops. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's it for my health food store haul. And again, the name of the health food store that I attended is in Chicago. It's called South Time Health Food Store. It's on 95th, like between Western and Damon. But the staff in there is great. They're so knowledgeable. Like it's a lady and I think it's an older lady too. I don't know if that's her mom or not, but Anything that you're dealing with, you walk in there, you, you talk to them, they're going to recommend stuff. So, I really like them. But, yeah, um, if you're seeing this, take it as a sign. Like, if low vibes are following you or if you just attracting bad luck and bad things keep happening, take a trip to the health food store. It's not going to be cheap. I spent over $90 in a, just on those things that I showed you. But what is the price that you could put on your health? You know what I'm saying? Like, we buy clothes, shoes, jewelry, bag, cars, all of that. But invest in your health because you only get one body. You only get one life. So I am definitely trying to keep my vibes high. Forget the stuff with the bank, with the ex and all of that stuff. So, yeah. Hope y'all like this. So like this, subscribe, and stay tuned because I have to tell y'all in depth about the different low vibrational things that happened to me today but i don't want to put it all in one video you know i gotta spread it out try and get my watch hours up so yeah like subscribe comment and yeah take care until next time